In an incident in the Belgorod region of Russia, a Ukrainian, sabotaged, group entered Russian territory and launched an attack on a town, resulting in injuries to at least eight individuals, according to the governor of the region. While a Ukrainian official acknowledged that the group consisted of Russian nationals, they maintained that the individuals were acting independently. Meanwhile, Ukraine asserted that it still retains control over a portion of Bakhmut, despite claims from Russian private military group Wagner and Moscow officials that they had seized the eastern city. The Zaporizhia nuclear power plant in Ukraine faced a precarious situation when it temporarily lost its external power supply, according to the United Nations nuclear watchdog. The vulnerability of the power plant raised concerns about its ability to operate safely. In response to Ukraine's request for F-16 fighter jet training for its pilots, President Joe Biden expressed support. However, analysts cautioned that these jets alone would not be a comprehensive solution for Ukraine's challenges. In the attack that took place in the Belgorod region, Governor Vyacheslav Gladkov confirmed that there were no civilian fatalities in Belgorod. He reported that several people sustained shrapnel wounds in the town of Gravoron, where shells hit an administrative building and caused damage to three residential buildings that caught fire. Additionally, a kindergarten in the nearby village of Zamostai was hit by a shell, resulting in injuries to another woman. While a Ukrainian official acknowledged that the units involved in the operation were part of Ukraine's defense and security forces, they maintained that the individuals were acting independently. Andriy Yusev, a representative of Ukraine's Defense Intelligence Agency, confirmed that the operation was carried out by Russian citizens. The incident highlights the ongoing tensions between Ukraine and Russia, with cross-border attacks and territorial disputes exacerbating the already fragile situation. Both sides continue to assert their positions, with Ukraine emphasizing its independence from Russian influence and Russia asserting its authority in the region. The situation surrounding the Zaporizhia nuclear power plant further raises concerns about the potential risks and consequences of these escalating conflicts. The international community closely monitors the developments in Ukraine and Russia, calling for a peaceful resolution.